Evening everybody. Uh, don't worry, you're not going mad. This is going to be a video about my GTI getting its exhaust and cold air intake put on and luckily I did manage to get the diffuser put on as well. You'll see that from our previous video. But I just thought I would add in this little extra bit here because if you've seen from my channel then I did do a video on the modifications before they went on the car. So I thought I would just do a quick video of those new pieces that have arrived the day after I did that video um, and just give you a little show of them before they go on the car as well. So hopefully I'll be able to get those things put on the car next week. I'll give the guys a ring down at AAT, see if they can do that for me. They said that should be okay. And hopefully I can film that getting done as well. So I haven't, I haven't done any video of the, of the car since the modifications were made to it. I have got some pictures though, just as a little teaser. So I'll put the pictures of the car on after the video is finished of the exhaust and the air take and the diffuser getting put on so you, just so you can see and then remember to subscribe and you'll be able to see a video that I do of the actual exhaust. Um, the guys told me there, you'll see from the video that um, when we started up it's not massively impressive but, but it was just done, it wasn't even warm or anything like that, um, it doesn't make a big load of noise but I never intended it to. It will bed in, um, the guys said there it will bed in. Um, there was a few little issues with it, I, I'm not going to go into it, it wasn't quite right but I'm not going to go into that. Um, it's on, um, the air takes on and the diffusers on and I've got two of the other parts I've described in my video which I'll show you just now. So as I said, make sure you subscribe and then you'll be able to see these new bits going on. So I'll get those bits on just now and then you'll see the car down at the garage getting the work done. I did do a little intro while I was down at the garage so I'll put that in as well. So again, thanks for watching and I will get these parts out now and we can have a look at what we've got. Okay, so again, I've not had this out. It did come immediately after I finished filming and uploading all that footage of the other mods that I've got. So as you'll see from the intro there, it's the Maxton Designs. And again, I'll do a link for progressive parts so you know about them. So let's get this out and see what we look like and you'll be able to see what I've got in here. It's the last two things. If you've watched more of the videos, you'll be able to probably guess the things that are missing from in here. And again, just to warn you, the cats are about, running about, so if they're here, they're here. They might make it a bit more interesting than I can. So, as I said, I've not had it out. It's very long again, so this might be quite tricky. Ooh. Right, I think I'm gonna need scissors again, so here we go for a fast forward again. <laughs> right, we've got them. Oh, so look, look here. I might just be able to see a little sneak. Right, Mr. Man, you need to get off. It's all going to come out together because I guess the other end's going to be the same as well, isn't it? Right, watch out, Harry. Okay, Mr. Man. Right. Hmm. Okay. Oh no. There we go. Oh yes. So, Maxton Designs from Progressive Parts, and I'll get them out of this packaging and show you a bit more because it's the black gloss stuff again, so that should match up. Harry likes them as well anyway, so let's get these out of this packaging, carefully. I was just starting to get so worried there because there's loads of scratches, the scratches all over it. But it's got a protective film on. And it tells me there, I just read that and I was like, oh my god, thank god for that. Because I was going, oh no, this has got stuff all over it. Well you can scratch it now because it's got a protective thing on. Crazy cat, right? So that is the front splitter. I'll bring it in. So again, I'll try and get this into the picture. My, my goodness, that is big. Right, where do I need to come to there? Can we get that in there? Woo. Okay, so this is the front splitter. I'll try and bring it in and do one of them bad boys for you. Ooh. If I can. Okay, so. That's it. 
Okay, so there we go, front splitter. So that will sit obviously underneath the car like that again. Can we see that? We can. Oh, I'm trying to get out of the way of it. So as I said in the video I was doing about the other parts, one of the reasons I selected this particular one is because of these spines, again, which match the rear diffuser, which you'll see from the pictures, which I flick up at the end of them being on the car. And if you watch and subscribe, you'll see the other videos as well. So what I like about these, again, I'm going to flip it over my head here. So hang on again. I don't know whether you can see that. I like this bits. So Maxton Designs little logo, and that would be obviously in the middle. Again, so there we go. Big giant splitter. Excellent. I'll try and show you the scratches. Here, again, I don't know whether you're going to be able to pick them up. It's all marked. It's all scratched. But then there's that nice label that saved my life. Okay, so that's that. Next. Okay, so front splitter. There we go. Down and resting. And then the next, which you'll have guessed, so I'm just going to tell you what it is. It's the side skirts. Let me come round. Okay. Again, these are all scratched. Oh, now I know. Yes. So again, the Maxton designs. I'll bring it in closer. Okay. So again, I'll try and do something that I can work here. So there's not much to see here, is there? It's just a side skirt. I don't really know how I can show you this. It'll be interesting. Or this bit here. So from here, underneath, this will all be underneath the car. That bit will be underneath the car. So again, on the end, we've got the nice logo of the Maxton design. It is covered in plastic again, so you, I'll just flick that up. Can I flick that up and over? So I'll flick that up and over so you can get a better. So it looks nice, doesn't it? So it must sit like that, because otherwise you're not going to be able to see it. It can't be underneath like that, and that must go underneath. So that's the part there. Let me draw it through the camera. Side skirts. Times two of those. And that's them. So, front splitter and side skirts. And I just wanted to show you this very, very quickly. Not my actual water registration, it's just because I bought these and they're I didn't just go for standard, and again, I don't know whether you're going to be able to get the effect on there, but I didn't just go for the standard ones. I went for these gel ones, which were expensive. They were £62 for these, and I took and had a little GTI put in the middle as well, just because I fancied it. So it's like the gel inserts, so it's nice. They're very tactile. Not that I want anyone coming up and rubbing against my car. Each to their own, I suppose. So yeah, so they are the gel ones. There's other ones you can get which are like block lettering and some other sort of shading ones as well. It's down in front of me, that's why I'm looking at the ground. They're from PFC Plates, which apparently is Europe's leading number plate supplier. And when I looked at other ones, these look like good quality and they were reasonably priced. So just a little shout for them, I suppose, but I just wanted to show you the gel and they'll go on my Mark 7.5 as well. So that's that. So I'll let you go and you can crack on and watch. Probably be doing it in speeding up mode because otherwise that'll be, you'll be there for about three hours watching that. So I'll speed that up mode and I'll chuck some shots in at the end that I took after the car had come off. As I said, there is a shot of the car off the ramp and being revved up and there's not much going on there, but I didn't expect there to be and the guys there are quite rightly pointing out that that'll take time. But since I've had it back and I've driven it two or three times, it's already got louder. 
So you can all wait to see that come in the new exhaust on the car and I'll do a video of that in a week or so once it's bedded in and maybe making a few more noises. So, so we'll click on to that now. Again, thanks for watching. Subscribe to the channel so that you can see more content coming. Um, so there'll be nothing from me at the end of the video. It'll just be the pictures I'll put on. Um, again, so thanks for watching the video and enjoy the changes getting made to the car. Ta-da! Okay, so I'm here at AAT Performance in Telford. Uh, we're just about to get the exhaust and the cold air intake put on. Um, so the guys are going to do that for me now. So they're just going to start doing it. I was just in on the ramp. So call back when we're in the way.
feel like they'd be more straightforward for you. One day, one day some of the kids from the neighborhood carried my mother's groceries all the way home. You know why? It was out of respect. No near man, the original nata. Take it and take jig. You can't put your the shire fags. And when we come with murderation, all original gangster man. Hey, when we tell them now, you hear me come and imitate, originate, we come originate. All right, mate. Now what you doing, mate? Hey, when we tell them come with them about gears, I'm gonna stop that. Watch me tell them, oh boy. Watch this. Big in a jungle Where we tell the boy, watch it now man Me a the nutta, original Bad man, bad man, bad nutta Original man, 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 nutta Original man, man, bad man, bad nutta Original man, 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 Me a the nutta, me bad at the bad boy Cause it a beta Lock up the jet that way you got sky water In a one school, them car make up for me Bad at the predator and the jump on the other Bad at the cartel and the damn dad Hey, 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 you never know the article, me say them in a jungle 